What's up, YouTube? I may have done a video about this. I don't think I did. Uh, on why I chose the auto repair business. Well, when I was a small kid, mom and dad didn't have a lot of money, and my dad wasn't a super car guy, but he sure did try and fix his cars. Uh, and I watched him do it in the driveway. And the worst experiences that I can remember from me tried doing his head gaskets on his Buick Regal himself. Uh, and he screwed it up, and then he had to take it to Pete Clark's in, in Williamstown. That's where we lived when we were little. Uh, so he wasn't super car guy. But I was always, you know, as I got older, into taking bicycles apart, and toy cars, and, you know, stuff in the house. And I was always interested in all that stuff. And then uh, when I got older, uh, and you know, get some friends, I had some friends that were like co into cars and you know, I'm saying under 17, you know, we're just dreaming about having our cars. And high school, I took industrial arts and auto shop. I wound up spending, you know, my whole high school uh, classes, classroom activities all in the auto shop. Uh, that's how much I was interested in it. I had no interest in really anything else. And the industrial arts team let me do that, come down there and work on cars and construction trees and blah, blah, blah. So to make a long story short, it's time to get a job. Uh, there was a guy in my neighborhood, Ben, who worked for Midas. I was very close to him. And, you know, he was the rich guy in the neighborhood. He wasn't super rich, but compared to me, who was super poor in my family, you know, he had the nice house. He had the wife. It's beautiful. And he had the Corvette and the airplanes and, all, you know, all the toys. He knew I liked cars and liked working on cars. So he gave me a shot when I was 18 or 17, something like that to work for Midas at 5.50 an hour. And I really enjoyed it. And I excelled well there and I did very well. I was, became a manager within three years, spent 10 years with them. Uh, but the, what, what really got me is Midas has a, a very intense training program and uh, they got me on camera and we were doing video sales training. And they said, why, why, do you, why did you choose this profession? And it was, it was more about, I really liked cars, and I really liked helping people fix their cars. Um, yeah, and then I still kind of feel that way today, but the people, the public, make me miserable. Uh, and that's why I have people at the counter. You know, some people are super nice and, and, are, and uh, are great and receptive and want you to take care of them, and other people are just complete a-holes. Uh, and I don't tolerate that. But yeah, that's, that's the story, and here we are... Uh, 91 to now is like 30 years, I guess. Yeah, 30 years later. I worked for Meineke prior to that for five years. So I kind of learned both sides of the kings of the uh, exhaust system worlds. And then I bought my own franchise uh, close to 15 years ago. And rock and rolling. Thanks for watching.